Hey everyone, welcome to another Tactics Puzzles with Andrew. I'm going to be doing some more as part of my training. So here we have another puzzle. So my opponent's just captured on Bishop on E3. So, so I haven't spotted anything immediately. That would win me the game. Um, let's have a look. Yeah, this one's quite tough. This one's quite a tough one. Um, not gonna lie. Hmm. So part of me sees uh, queen to e4. I want to kind of have a look at this move for a bit. So the idea of that, of course, is just threatening mate, just quite bluntly. Um, now the only move that he can really do to block it is the move uh, f3. Now from there I can maybe do rook captures on g2 with check. After he catches back with the king I can then storm in on f3 with check again and then there'll be mates very shortly afterwards. So I quite like that plan but I want to... the only thing I'm worried about is what if he doesn't do anything to respond to that threat. So if he so I captures he then moves the rook the uh, king sorry. So h1 it wouldn't work, that'll be checkmate very quickly. Then king to f1. I guess I have um queen to d3. I think that will just win on the spot. Okay, so I think I'm gonna try that. I don't see any other good moves apart from G uh, F3? I'm pretty sure there's nothing there. All right, so I'm going to do it. So he's played it. Capture. Okay, so it's taking me down that other line. I do want to just check though, just to see if I was right in my assumptions after King to F1. Uh, it would be interesting. And if he went here, yeah, okay, immediately checkmate in one on the spot. That I, that I missed. I actually thought maybe queen to d3, but actually, yeah, queen to queen to f3 is even stronger. Uh, just be mate. And, well, she's got this move, hasn't he? But then after that, that's quite a nice move. Checkmate straight away. Cool. Okay, right. Let's go back to do some more puzzles. Okay, so the first move that springs to mind is knight here with check and just take the queen. But I just want to be a bit careful, I just want to count material for a moment here. So after that, let's see, we're all balanced, aren't we? So I um, just want to make sure he hasn't got any counter threats there with check. No, it's nothing. It's not even a not really even a move, is it? Uh, okay, I think I'm going to play that. And just check. Okay, so there's the check. This is what I was kind of a little bit worried about. So I've got to be careful I move this king. If I move it here, it's just a check and it captures my queen. So I've got to sidestep this way. Ooh, interesting. Oh, of course. Right, I've got the rook protecting. <laughs> so that doesn't matter at all. Just let's have a look. So I was a bit too hasty on that one. So why can't he do this move? I'm assuming it's just because of captures. Capture back. He's doing okay, isn't he? But why is this move no good? Ooh, okay, there's an interesting line. Let's have a look, check. Why can't I go here now? Ooh, that is sneaky. Because he's, he's got this little attack here. Oh, I didn't notice that counterplay. 
Oh, that is a really good move. Yeah, so after this, I've got this. And now I've got to capture the rook. And black is just ahead here now. That's quite a cool puzzle, actually. So, yeah, that's just looking at the importance of spotting counter threats, putting yourself beyond defeat. Okay. That was a small setback, but we'll hopefully we can uh, move on from it. Alright, so I think the move straight away is his queen takes here after rook captures. That's that's just the winning move, isn't it? I can't see any any good way of defect, deflecting that. So I think I'm just going to do it. There we go. Nice and easy. Got back all the points that I just lost there. Okay. So I think it's just check and then move forward. Can't see anything wrong with that. Done. Nice and quick and easy. Alright. I want to start sort of building pace on things, puzzles like that. Obviously, in real life, if I'm playing sort of classical games, uh, you know, I, I can take as much time as I like, but it's good just to sort of quickly flow through them now, as opposed to uh, taking my time on them, because it should be sort of second nature at this point. Right then, so I believe the solution here is something to do with this queen. Um, so I can immediately see that it's not in the most safe of places. So if I can g4, his queen, and, oh no, my, my knight's protected, okay. So where can his queen move to? Absolutely nowhere, from the looks of it. If he goes to f6, I've got this bishop move here. And yeah, that's just, that's just winning, isn't it? Nice and straightforward, that one. I'm surprised it's so highly rated, though. I mean, that's that's pretty crazy. But the target time, 17 seconds. I think that's uh, that's a little unrealistic, shall we say. Um, okay. Here we are. Next puzzle. So I think the move is just night, night here. <laughs> I can't... Uh, but I want to say that there's a checkmate here somewhere. But I just like that move. <laughs> I think that just wins. Ooh, okay. When you see a good move, look for a better one. This is one of those situations. So knight e7 is still winning loads, but actually rook here is a bit better. Hmm, queen to f7. So attacking the knights. Then here. Ah. Oh yeah, that is really strong. That's really, really strong. It captures back, just take the rook queen. King takes, that comes a check. Yeah, that's completely working. But I should just want to go back for a moment. See, I think that's that's really good. That's a really good move. Let's just see what's wrong. Ah, knight captures. Oh, right, okay. Forgot about that move. <laughs> yeah, that's no good. That's no good at all. Yeah, I missed that completely. Okay, right, let's go to the next puzzle. So yeah, that was a com complete miss. Miss there. Just need to take my time a little bit more, I think, on these. Because I am rushing a little bit. I don't need to.
Okay, so I can see one solution that I really like. Bishop to a5 comes with check. If he moves to d8, I've got rook to e8 check, and that wins. If he moves the pawn forward, I just capture the queen. So I think I, I really like that move. So I'm going to play that. Capture the queen, and that's done. Cool. That's a nice little puzzle. Okay. So. Let's have a look. Okay, so there's no sort of mating threats. I'm thinking um, f6 is a good move. That's the first one that springs to mind. So immediately the problem here for white, blot white is just simply this queen is pinned. Well, the knight's pinned to the to the queen. So that'll be my first thought to win some good amount of material. Yeah, I'm quite happy with that move. Can't see any sort of counter punches that he could throw. He can't move the knight anywhere to try and get out of things. I just take the queen straight away. If he moves the queen away, well, I just capture this knight. Ooh, actually, that is a good counter punch, but can I afford to take it? So yeah, I didn't see that move. I mean, it's the right move to an f6, but actually now I don't know where to go from here. So I can capture the knight. He captured my rook. I capture his bishop. I'm still up the exchange. I'm going to go for it. Okay, so it's the right move. It's a, that's a tough little puzzle because actually I'm not super far ahead. I don't like the queen here, but actually I've got enough pieces. My king is actually quite safe. And then this is this is falling in a moment. But actually, I mean, when you look at it, white black is still really far ahead. I mean, he's up. Oh, he's low. He's really far ahead. Um, He's up an exchange. Well, he's he's up a bishop for two pawns, isn't he? No, two a bishop for one pawn. Sorry. So yeah, I think black is definitely winning here. A tough little puzzle. Okay, so this is a tough one. Capture the knights after. So okay, that's the best worst case scenario. What if he captures back with his with his king? Capture back the pawn with check. I don't really see a good way after that. Maybe it's something to do with the... no. 
after that knight's got too many squares to go to. Um, is this bishop trapped? I don't know. Uh, this is a really hard one. Um, I'm struggling with this one. I mean, I win a pawn in this in this scenario, but I can't see the good good sort of follow up. I'm gonna go for it. Hmm. Okay. So I can capture his pawn on d6 and then just crash in on his other pawn. So I will be up two pawns in any case. Okay, right, so he's coming crashing in. And capture his bishop, he comes to check, but then I can just block it. I don't know. That was a really <laughs> weird puzzle. <laughs> I didn't really expect the next few moves. Um, yeah, that was a strange one. Do want to have a look at that. don't know what the hell was going on in that puzzle. <laughs> just seemed to be really random moves from Black. So, okay, after that, capture. So if I, t if I was more looking, concerned about what happened if he did king here, I guess, I guess this is no good. It likes the move. I mean, actually, knight, knight takes on g5 is not even that popular. After that, that. So if I took. Knight takes on d4. Yeah, that's interesting. That was a move I didn't see. But then that's even stronger, I think. Uh, I kind of saw maybe, maybe knight's coming over here. Looks I've got this threat. I've got this threat. There's a few things going on. Right then, I think that's going to do it for this little small session. I didn't want to do a particularly long one uh, for today. Um, I anyway, hope you enjoyed it. Take care.